What's going on guys, it's your boy Cash. This is like a little segue, a little segment, a little thing, because these spectates um, uh, get really, really spicy during the events. Uh, the festivals, if you guys don't know, if you <clears throat> are doing your, your daily uh, spectate, they actually will then have you spectate not only just ranked matches, but they also usually have you do the festival stuff as well. So I just saw one that was just insane, and I'm pretty much the only reason why I'm recording is because I'm pissed off I didn't record the other one. But let's check out these matches. But nine times out of ten, what we're watching, uh, you'll, you'll probably notice based on the cards that you'll see, is that it's going to be from the festival. So it's going to be pretty fun to see what pe what decks people are playing, how they're piloting it, and all this other good stuff. So without further ado, let's watch a couple matches. So first off, it's going to start off with the Resonator. Resonated by Karibi, Karibi Photon. So I'm very interested to see uh, what uh, things is. I wish I could. Can I look at this deck, actually? I think I'm allowed to look in, yes. This is how you can tell, nine times out of 10, this guy's going synchro. So he's actually using the, the red Archfiend deck, and I have no idea how good that deck is in the grand scheme of things. So let's see what, what uh, he does, what he's able to bring out. And I do think that they have an assault mode, don't they? Or, or is he just running this for shits and giggles? Gonna be leveling up, this is going into nine. Hot Red Dragon Archfiend, gonna go in there. This, this deck has crazy uh, cycling power until you get one big bad. Let's check out what the big bad does though. He can target one face up card uh, on the field and get it until the end of the turn when the card inflicts battle damage. Uh, you could target a tuner in your graveyard to put summon in defense mode and then you and it goes up. I think it goes up, this is nine. Yeah, it goes up to like 12. <laughs> it kind of crazy and has Ben de Fleur in there as well. But I don't think this card has enough to stop whatever this guy's doing. No extra deck. So we're looking at someone that's looking to be a nuisance. Cup of ace. Gets the heads. Did he? Is there a self OTK deck in? Um, oh, there goes my other video. Just finished. All right, he's gonna draw two cards now. Um, he can't be doing Exodia. Got Brian Sanko gets the query uh, thing back. I'm very curious on what kind of deck this guy's running. Toon World activate, but is it self OTK? Yes, he actually found a. They still, they still have him out there. My word. I, I think that. Uh, self OTK in this format is just it would, I feel like it would take too long Outside of now the guy is probably just gonna attack and Win really this is the match that I start off on come on guys. Oh No, we're back in ranked. I'm gonna skip over this. We already seen this. I'm, I'll never watch a Person do this combo. I don't get it as soon as I turn the camera on I watched so many cool spectate matches, and I'm like, damn, because you can't save them. I, I really wish that you could save them. That would I would actually save a lot of stuff. All right, this is the synchro event. Yes. Okay. That's all I'm looking for. I'm looking for synchro event. All right. So we got Drytron, Crytron, Primeval River, Justin Timberlake. Uh, deck going against what are we going against over here? Huh? Alpha Master, so danger. So I, I'm pretty sure that this is definitely the synchro event, and let's see what this guy has cooking up. He's gonna get his thing negated, but I think he can just activate it again, right? Uh, some, like you have to be careful what what you decide to ash, because a lot of the times the cards aren't like oh we're actually using Sekka's light, which is interesting to see. Gonna be going into that synchro Shokan into a nine into the QB in the building. Virtual World I do know is pretty strong right now and that's gonna boom, get that card removed from play. Gonna really hinder the uh, the Dry Charm players. Uh, probably not specifically Dry Charm, but like, it really hurts them to have all those cards removed from play. Gonna go for the Dry Charm Nova. Gonna Ash that, now that makes sense to Ash. Say eh eh, remove from play. Go with the Time Lord. Time Lord's going to attack. Actually kills the card, but I think, uh, let's see, uh, and it's just 2,000. This guy's gonna go away after the fact, so unless he has a way to kill it right now, possibly with like a droplet and, and then a destruction. He's gonna remove from play. Oh, Arch Nemesis, I love it. Then he's gonna do that, choose Insect, and then he's gonna be able to push. That is actually for lethal. I don't know, I'm <laughs> just, I promise. Maybe it's just the first one you do per day. The first, the first one for the daily is is crazy, and then every other one after that is just hot dookie. One more try. I want to do this regularly though, um, because I do want to see. Hold on, 
I feel like I just gotta check this guy's decks. Maxi, we got some blue eyes stuff. So we got some blue eyes. Synchro Festival stuff versus face down, probably gonna get annihilated. Lead Brigeki? No, we're gonna lead off with Dragon Shrine. Okay. Uh, Melody. Discards the Imperience. That's kinda. I don't know about that. I feel like the Maxi would be better. Because this guy, I, I feel like the other player's not really doing too, too much. Turn two ends the turn. Can this thing not attack when it does that? Is that what just happened? Cannot attack the turn it does that. I was about to say, bro, you just missed 3k. So, okay, sets up a nice little board here. Two eights. There's no XZs. So, here we go. He has no uh, maxi. So, okay. He uh, The maxi is going to get at least one draw here. Actually, at least two. Probably three or four. That was the thing is that the other match that I saw, I, I should stop talking about it because I'm just. I'm. I'm Living the life. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna go into the junk speeder. We already know. Junk speeder is gonna summon uh, 8,000. Iris the Sword Soul. What the hell? What are you doing in there? Okay. Iris Soul Soul actually gets to activate from the hand. Uh, so summon this type of hand. You can summon summons a thing and hand deck. Oh, she has her own animation. I will. I'm looking forward to that deck. I, I I don't know what it is, but I just like the fact that it's called Sword Soul. Now him doing this though does limit his actual space. He's gonna be able to get a, a Stardust card from the hand, uh, from the deck into the hand, activates it. I think this puts a let, yeah, puts something on the top of the deck, and a Synchro again. He's gonna draw. Remember, Maxi is in effect. Formula Synchron. He's get to draw a card himself. Then he's gonna use this Formula Synchron. Gonna Synchro. So pretty much, he's saying, I don't give a damn what you're gonna do. I'm gonna make a, a crazy board. Destroy one of those uh, special summon monsters from the extra deck. So he's going to destroy the formula synchron here. Now, can he activate each effect or just one? Can he use each uh, effect? So I think technically he can activate three effects on this turn. So he's going to be able to do that. Synchro Shokun is going to be going into a number six Stardust Charge, which gives him a. Let's allow him to draw. Look at he's just. He's just. <laughs> this is what you see. Like. It's like a whole fan of, of cards, but he can't use any of these on his turn though. He does have a bunch of eights out here. Alright, Stardust uses its effect. Doppelganger happens again. Doppelganger does not have a once per turn thing at all. So he's accepting at this point to just go and do as much possible as he can. Don't even think about it. Just just close your eyes and let it happen. Uh, this is the synchro con oh, forbidden droplet. So pretty much when this guy's turn, the blue eyes player's turn comes up. He's going to have a lot to do, but this Stardust deck has a lot of negates that they can set up, and that's probably what they're going to end up doing. Doesn't attack. Can't get over 3,000 or any of the 2,500s. So, probably lead off Regeki. Lead off Harpies. Into Silver Cry. Into, like, trying to mask it so you can't... So, wait, no. None of these Stardust can actually do that. I'm thinking it's a regular Stardust, but it's a funny Stardust. Nice. Harpy's gonna kill the back row, then into Forbidden Droplet. Two. Discards four, I guess, because he has too many cards in his hand. Activates the Regeki. No way to uh, do anything. Use. Ah, uh, well. Well, there you have it. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I could keep fishing for more. I think that was the best that I was going to say. God, man. I, I, I need to stop saying it, but I really, really like that other match. Anywho, uh, I will be showing and trying to find as many of these spicy spectates because they are, like I said, as I was explaining, they're from the, uh, the festival. So you get to see some people, what decks they're running. You saw the guy doing some type of self-OTK. Um, didn't seem as successful. Uh, he just, the other guy's going to win. So I guess that that's still somewhere in the mix. But yeah, it's pretty cool to see what decks the other people are running and maybe you might see something that you're interested in and yeah. But anyway, that's it for me and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.